Hello everybody, it's me again. It's Russell Mills, April 2nd, 2018 on a Monday. I want to say hello to everybody. Hope everybody's blessed. Hope everybody's, um, you know, having a good day. Hope we have a good day today. I just want to ask us as, uh, as, as a country, as a nation, um, why do we get so angry all the time over, over a lot of stuff? Um, you know, it's just like, even me, you know, I, I get angered over a lot of stupid stuff in my life. And I'm saying, why do we get angry so much over nonsense, you know, or why do we hold grudges and get angry and, and feel like, you know, it's it's better to hold grudges, you know what I'm saying? Like, for an example, if somebody did, uh, did something wrong to you and you're going to say, oh, you know, this person screwed me and, you know, and I hate him and her for life or she cheated on me or he cheated on me or he abused me. And, and I'm not saying as a person we're not going to have a certain feeling or a certain way about how how things are all the time. But but we get angered, you know, even over the littlest things, you know what I mean? And I, I've had been in situations where people have held grudges against me over over stuff that they think is a big deal, you know what I mean? And to me, it's not that big of a deal, but they got upset about it and, you know, they felt a certain way about it and it's like people still keep constantly bringing it up and it's like, it's it's a shame that, you know, it's like as a human race, we judge so much because that's because we're born in sin, we're born into judgment. There's evil spirits in this world, um, first and foremost. So um, people got to understand that. it's not Everything's not God's world. Um, and it's not God's world. And unfortunately, I believe it says this in Matthew, I believe when, uh, the devil was tempting Jesus and telling him about, you know, you could have this whole world. Um, you know, I don't know what, you know, exactly what it was said, but I believe it was something to that, that extent. And, um, uh, it's a shame today that we hold so much anger and grudges over people you know, because see, it's like God doesn't judge the same way we do. You know what I mean? And and that's and that's the thing that people gotta understand. God doesn't judge the same way we judge. You know, because um, because trust me, you know, God God uh, loves us unconditionally, even when we screw up. But that doesn't mean just because we screw up, we we continue to screw up. You know what I mean? That doesn't mean just because God loves you, we continue to have. Um, anger against the next man or woman. You know what I mean? Do I struggle with that? Absolutely. I struggle with a lot of things in my life constantly. And, you know, it's it's too bad sometimes. I, I struggle with it. And I'm sure millions and millions of other people struggle with it in this life. And uh, we have to understand that this life is not, not, you know, this is a wicked world, you know, first and foremost, because we made it wicked. You know, we, you know, we made it the way it is where we're so angry and, and, and so judgmental and so, you know what I'm saying? Just arrogant. And, and we act like we're better than everybody. And it's like, um, we have to stop being angered, you know what I'm saying? And being mad about a lot of stuff. Cause, cause let me tell you something, as we already know, you only get one shot at this life, one life, every single time that you're born, one life. That's it. So if we continue to uh, hold grudges, because let me tell you something. I'm going to say this again to, to people. We're not going to be blessed and, you know, and go to heaven having anger and having issues. You know what I'm saying in our life? And like I said, there's a lot of evil spirits in this world that make us the way they are. But it's like um, there's so much temptation out there. And that's that's not godly. You, you know, I get tempted, you know, even, you know, and stuff like that. We all watch or do things that we shouldn't do, or, you know what I mean, or, or say things we shouldn't do. And it's like, it's because, unfortunately, there's a lot of evil spirits in this world. And um, if we allow evil spirits in our soul, in our mind, you know, those evil spirits a lot of time take control of our body, you know what I'm saying? And we don't even understand. That's why, you know, there's so much killing out there. There's so much people, you know, that are, um, that are gay, that are, you know what I mean, you know, or, you know, whatever, because it's like, you, I feel just like anything else. You're not born gay. You're born into this world that's wicked. So at the end of the day, this is a wicked world, you know what I mean? And, and we have to be careful 
of allowing demons in our life because unfortunately we do allow a lot of evil spirits in our life and a lot of us don't understand it. It's like if I'm screaming and yelling at somebody at the top of my lungs, why am I doing that? Unfortunately, because I let demons into my life. You know what I'm saying? That person let demons in our life and we don't even understand it. Why we're so angered where that trigger comes from, you know, in our minds. It's like, I don't like to be angry all the time. You know what I'm saying? But I don't think a lot of people like to be angry. And, you know, and, and, and like I said, if you have evil spirits in your, in your soul, in your mind, and, and those evil spirits take control of your body, then, you know, who knows what you're going to do. That's why there's so much killings going on. That's why there's, you know, evil, just like even even in the movies that we watch, you know what I'm saying? There's always somebody getting killed or, or murdered or something like that. It's like, you know, it, it's it's like they don't always glorify the good, you know, in, 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 in movies all the time. You know, I'm not saying there aren't movies out there that aren't spiritual, there aren't movies that aren't loving and stuff like that. Of course there are. But what I'm saying is that's not always glorified all the time, you know, the, 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 you know, it's the gore and the horror and, and the shooting and, you know what I mean, that stuff like that that makes us, but we just have to stop, man, you know what I'm saying, because like I said, um, God is going to judge us on Judgment Day, you know what I'm saying, and myself, you know, all the, you know, the temptation, you know, whatever, you know, you know, whatever you watch, you know what I mean, it's good out there, bad out there, whatever, you know what I'm saying, it's just like, we all have to be careful about what we watch and what we say. Is it easy? No. You know, maybe for some it is. You know, maybe for some it's not. Like me, you know, it it, it is what it is. Sometimes it's easy, sometimes it's not, you know, depending on the situation, depending on who I'm dealing with or or, or how or how I feel about a certain uh, situation individual. So it's like we, we just have to stop, you know what I mean? And we have to just, you know, try to give more love in this world because, you know, there's there's not a lot of love in this world. And and it's just like, um, you know, there's a lot of confusion in this world. That's why I'm gonna say this again. That's why Men and women aren't dating anymore. That's why there's you see more same-sex marriages, more same-sex relationships than you ever had because the energy between men and women is is dying out slowly. I'm not saying that men and women that are dating and getting getting married, they they they're getting married and dating every day. That's fine, but it's not as high as it used to be. You know what I'm saying? It used to be at an extreme high. You know, you know, men men were marrying. You know, their women. And, you know, now it's like you're having a same-sex uh, marriage, a same-sex relationship, you have kids involved, and it's like, my question is to the people that have same-sex relationships, that have kids, it's like, what are you teaching your kids? Like, some people might say, oh, it's, you know, they're trying to love that uh, person, and and I'm sure they do love that person, you know what I'm saying? But But it's like, what are you teaching your kids? It's like, you know, I'm not saying... Every kid's gonna turn out to uh, gay if 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 their mother, uh, if their two moms or their two dads are, are are dating. You know what I'm saying? But but you know it could be an influence. You know what I'm saying? Like it's like if 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 you've seen one, one biological parent, you know what I'm saying, doing it. You know you know with you know with another person, and it's like I don't know, man. It's just like. What what what's the influence on these kids? That's my only question. It's like, what you know, where do these kids fit in? You know what I'm saying? And it's like, um, you know, how are they gonna turn out? You know what I'm saying? See, and it's like, how can they explain to their you know to their friends? You know, when they kids, oh my mom, oh you know my mom, uh, my two moms, uh, my two dads, and it's like. If, if, if let's say their friend has a mother and father, and they're gonna be like, yeah, I'm going over my, uh, you know, I'm going over my friend's house and. My friend uh, has two dads, and it's like, you know what I mean? Like, it, it's just like, well, it has two moms, and it's like, it, it's like the energy today is, is gone, man. Like, it's just between, you know, men and women. It's like, that's why men are doing what they're doing, and, and women are doing what they're doing. And I'm not saying, it's it's it's, it's a backwards world we live in. You know, it's, it's so much temptation and out there. It's a lot of aggravation. It's it's just, you know, you just got to pray for this world, man. You got to pray because it's like, this, this world can make you crazy. This world can make you tempted, you know what I'm saying, if, if you allow these evil spirits in your life. And it's like, it's not easy because, like I said earlier, it's not God's world. This is the devil's world. So, you know, we have to be careful out there. But, you know, 
I just pray for this world. I pray for this country. We need more love. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to sit back and say all my videos are going to always be, you know, love and, you know what I'm saying, all the time because sometimes they won't be. You know, the, it, it depends on how I feel, my mood, what I see out in the world. You know what I mean? It's just, just too much shit going on today. It's like people killing each other, shootings at, in, in, in schools just like they did in Florida. You know, it was like 17 kids killed out there in Florida. It's like, you know what I mean? Like, you know, and, and it's like, and, 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 the, and the guy that did it was a young, you know, white uh, racist supremacist, like, you know, white, you know, white, white racist supremacist, like, it's, it's like, I just don't understand it, bro, like, what, where does this mindset come from, like, you know, but like I said, it's just, it's, if you allow the devil in your life, you know, he, he he's going to take care of you, trust me, and, 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 and at the end of the day, when you sign that contract with Satan, um, you know, you're going to, you know, you're going to pay at the end. You know what I mean? He basically going to say, okay, you did my dirty work. Now you're going to burn in hell for the, for eternity, you know, and thank you. So, you know, this is how it is, but you know, I want everybody to have a good day. I hope uh, this video gets uploaded to YouTube. I don't know if it will or not, but, um, I'm, you know, I just hope everybody has a good day. You take care. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you want. You can just type in uh, Russell Mills, R-U-S-S-E-L-L-M-I-L-L-S, -L -L May 22nd, 2017. And just check out my videos if uh, you're interested. And bring, a, uh, bring a like or comment or subscribe. That's it. But everybody, take care. Have a good day. Peace.